February 14th, 2011. Happy Valentine's Day. Well, this is today's climate change update. Let's start with the extinction protocol. Sun unleashes powerful earthbound CME. Now I've confirmed this through spaceweather.com. Earth directed solar flare on February 13th at 1738 UT, Sunspot 1158 unleashed the strongest solar flare of the year so far. A M6.6 .6 category blast. Um, they are. The cloud will likely hit Earth's magnetic field on or about February 15th. High latitude sky watchers should be alert for auroras. So all my Northern Hemisphere people, please get your video cameras out and uh, share. <clears throat> Story below. Australians warned, beware of giant birds on the prowl for food. Uh, Queensland. Australians trying to rebuild in the wake of Cyclone Yassi have been warned to stay away from cassowaries, huge flightless birds with claws that can disembowel a human on the hunt for food after their habitat was destroyed by the storm. So we got giant birds on the prowl. Uh, Nepal had a 4.5 magnitude quake and they've got a fear piece running it's right on that um, the Indian plate. 6.0 earthquake strikes offshore from Bio Bio Chile. And that's about it for them today. Uh, Earthchanges.net, we have the cyclone Bengiza set to hit Madagascar. Madagascar is being lashed by heavy rains and thing, things are promising to get worse over the next few days. Tropical cyclone Bengiza is creeping ever closer. For the last few days, it's been swirling a few hundred kilometers offshore, with just outer fingers of the storm thrown westward towards the island. These outer bands have already have already brought a lot of rain, but the center of the storm, where the worst of the weather is, has not reached Madagascar yet. And uh, currently, the storm has sustained winds of nearly 160 kilometers per hour and gusts up to 195. This makes it the equivalent of a Category 2 hurricane. But the storm is still expected to strengthen as it creeps slowly westward. So this is a creeper heading right for Madagascar. Uh, we've got a big sinkhole in Hawaii on the Maui Island. Uh, it was big enough for a car to fall in. Heavy rains on the Maui Island. And uh, I'm not going to kill that word. Area caused ground to collapse right next to the road shoulder. A huge Hole is between Makala Street and Willop, Willop Drive. I know I'm just telling these names. The sinkhole is 15 feet deep and 40 feet wide. That's big enough for a vehicle to fall into. I would say, yeah. Uh, India cold wave revives, and um, due to rain and snow, several areas in the higher reaches were cut off from the rest of. Uh, the Parish Estate experienced another spell of snowfall today, receiving cold wave conditions. The hills and mountain passes, including uh, Lahal and Spiti and Kinnanar, have been uh, experiencing moderate to heavy snowfall since last evening. Telecommunication services were badly disrupted, and uh, which was already cut off by road from the rest of the state due to heavy snowfall. And uh, they're having heavy icy rain and cold winds um, in the lower regions. So they're having a pretty bad winter storm. And on the USGS, we just had a 6.6 .6 earthquake off uh, Mall, Chile, M A U L E. And that is just north of the Bio Bio Chile quakes that have been happening. So, yeah, that's about it for today. Um, if I missed anything, please let me know. Um, enjoy what you can. Thanks, everybody.